Next thing, I look directly at me. No talking from this moment on except for uh, me. Yeah. Hey, you and you to switch spots. You're too comfortable right there. There you go. There you go. Great big deep breath. And exhale. Yes. We're going to get started here in just a minute. If you're following instructions, if you're doing this properly, here's what you're going to expect or this is what you're going to experience. You will feel yourself just becoming very relaxed. You may find yourself leaning all the way to the left. Everybody lean up against the person to the left of you. All the way, all the way, all the way, all the way, all the way. All the way, all the way. There you go. Get comfortable. All the way, all the way. There you go. Or you may find yourself leaning all the way to the right. That's the other way. Yeah, there you go. Now you get to participate. <laughs> You'll find that person seated next to you will support you completely. No talking to anybody except for me, please. Kind of lean, young man. There you go. You may find yourself leaning all the way forward. And that's good, too. Everybody sit up straight in that chair. Feet flat on the floor. No talking to anybody else except for me. Sit up straight in that chair. There you go. <laughs> that wasn't a pretty pose. <laughs> We're going to get started here in just a minute. Now, here's where you're going to have to help me out. We're going to do what we call a quick induction. Therefore, I'm going to need it as quiet as possible. It means no talking. No laughing. Please do not call out the volunteers' names. The reason why is if it gets too noisy, then we have to start the induction all over again. It's not fair to you. You're patiently waiting. It's very rude to the volunteers trying to go under. Once they're under, that's different. Then you can make all the noise you want. In fact, the more you encourage the volunteers, I can attach an emotion to them, drop them down into a deeper state. It'll make for a much better show. But help me out for the next five or ten minutes. I need it as quiet as possible, please. And really great big deep breath. And then say, yeah, look directly at me. Great big deep breath. And exhale, good. Because it's a show, because we are kind of tight in here, I probably will not be able to work with all of you. So during the show, if I ask you to return to your seat in the audience, do it quickly and quietly. Doesn't mean you can't be hypnotized. It may not be your day. Maybe you have your mind on other things. Maybe you're just having a hard time concentrating or relaxing. So just, you know, I've had people come back, volunteer again, and do perfectly. So just relax and let it happen. I promise you, there's nothing in the entire universe that can keep you from being hypnotized other than yourself. Look directly at me. Because you volunteered, I know you want to do your very best. So all you have to do is just relax and let it happen. Everybody, relax those elbows. There you go. Yeah, really relax. You know, I just want you to be able to do this. So there you go. Great big deep breath. And exhale. Remember, this is nothing more than self-hypnosis. You're doing this on your own. I'm just the guy. Take a nice deep breath. And exhale. Good. Again, really deep. And exhale. Again, real deep and hold it. As you exhale, close your eyelids down. Close your eyes. Keep them closed until I ask you to open them. We're going to relax them a little bit more. You will see the individuals on the stage becoming more and more relaxed. They may find themselves leaning all the way to the left or leaning all the way to the right. They will find that person seated next to them will support them completely. Entering into a trance-like state of mind and body is an incredibly satisfying experience, a fascinating part of the show. So once again, help me out here. No talking, no laughing. Do not call out the volunteers' names. No talking, no laughing. <laughs> Please, no photography. Listen up real quick. This is quite